Sir William Garrow was a British barrister, politician, and judge known for his indirect reform of the advocacy system, which helped usher the court system used in most common law nations today. He introduced the phrase, innocent until proven guilty, insisting that defendants' accusers and their evidence must be thoroughly tested in court. Garrow was born to a priest and his wife in Munkin Hadley on 13th of April, 1760. After moving to Middlesex, Garrow was educated at his father's school in the village. This led to a pupillage with a Mr. Crompton. Garrow studied the law hard, viewing cases at the Old Bailey, and Crompton recommended that he become a solicitor or barrister. He quickly established a reputation as a criminal law barrister, particularly for the defendants, and in February 1793 was made a king's counsel by Her Majesty's government to prosecute cases involving treason and felonies. Garrow spent a short time on Parliament, but did not enjoy it. In 1817, he was made a baron of the Exchequer and a sergeant at law, forcing his resignation from Parliament, and he spent the next 15 years as a judge. On his resignation in 1832, he was made a privy councillor, a sign of respect Her Majesty's government had for him. He died on the 24th of September, 1840. For much of the 19th and 20th centuries, his work was forgotten by academics, and interest arose only in 1991 with an article by John Beattie titled Garrow for the Defense in History Today. Garrow is best known for his criminal defense work, which, though the example he set with his aggressive defense clients, helped establish a modern adversarial system used in most common law systems. Garrow is also known for his impact on the rules of evidence, coining the best evidence rule. His work was cited as recently as 1982 in the Supreme Court of Canada and 2006 in the Irish Court of Criminal Appeal.